Yeah, yeah so if we're just here running a program. You go to diagnosis, version. You have to be in um, privilege mode. What does that mean? Well, right now we are in privilege mode. So, go back, diagnosis, version. If you hit this arrow and do 1131 and input, it will come up here in this window and allow you to input. We're already in privilege mode, so it's not gonna let me do it again. Oh, okay. But that version won't be there. This comes up once you're in privilege mode. You don't need that though. You need this, that version, right arrow key, 1131 input. Okay. That puts you in privilege mode. Then di diagnosis monitor. And you've got all your addresses. Arrow down if you need to write in an address. There's your address. And if you do R you know, 2250, that brings up what you've got in that register. Okay. And then you could also search X, Y, yep. F. Yep. So you've got your X, which is your input, your Y, which is your output. Yeah. And, um, you know anything else there but we're in R2268 that's the register that we're in right now and then we convert our binary number to some to decimal long number decimal version. and you put it in the long or the short long oh, okay but your long and short they're they're, they're often the same but the sometimes same, they weren't except for I don't really understand how they're different. Yeah, and I don't either. But anyway, at any rate, you, yeah, that one's, that one's negative and that one's positive. It's like that one's no, rounding. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't know, it's weird. That one's, uh... At any rate, we put it in long. Put it in long. And... So then you just key in whatever number... Key in a number. Input. input but... One thing I always do is take a picture of the page. So That's then smart. If you accidentally change something, you can change it. Cool. Uh, and then, is there a reason to get out of privilege mode, or does that happen at restart? Or? It happens at restart. Oh, okay. But if it's something you just need to look at, you can go up to any one of these places here and look at it. You can go R2200. And you can look at your R register oh, okay. in both spots at the same time. Ah, okay. That so you way, can see, say that one, that one, and that one, and that one. Yeah, that way you can look at your registers. You can look at inputs simultaneously and outputs going on oh, at the same time. Oh, that is really cool. Yeah. Cool. Thank you.